Hi guys, Karen Visueta, how are you today? I'm excited to bring you a full body dumbbell strength workout. So you need a light, medium, and heavy set of dumbbells, a mat, and that's it. Let's go ahead and get started. We're gonna begin in a squat position, lifting the heart and chest. I want you to drop down for two, and then rising up, firing through that seat. Using that exhale to stand tall. All right, so guys, in this warm out, we wanna get those muscles ready to move to work. So we're thinking in our minds about turning on that seat. We got four more and I want you to add an upper body pull. High and wide row for four. Three, two, and one. Hands come behind the head, right knee steps back. We're gonna twist over the left, come to center and switch. So reversing lunge, rotation, center. Can I add one more thing? Reverse twist, open the arms, come back to center, reverse, twist, reach the arms, come back to center, lower, rotate, reach, center, there we go, drop, twist, reach, center, one more on each side, we're feeling that upper body also get warmed here, last one to the end, twist, center and separating those legs a little wider than hip distant coming to the right left toe up coming to the left and again feeling the inner thigh wake up one more on each side are we ready to work my friends and I want you to go ahead and grab medium to heavy dumbbells taking your load right to the chest we're gonna come down and hold lower for two Hold for two, press up through the legs and the arms. So it's a slow hold, two count, fire it up. We take it, squat for two, hold for two, press in, squeeze the glutes, drop the seat, hold the seat, whoo, overhead, how we doing? Down for two, hold for two, fire it up, nice job. Lower down, hold, pause, lift, press. Nice, nice, drop down, hold, pause, lift, press. One more, drop down, hold, pause, and press. Nice work. Reversing lunges, alternating. We're gonna step back right, press, and return, okay? So bicep curl on the way back. Hold that, go a little lighter if you need to. Medium to heavy load, right leg lunges. As you curl, we're nice and stable. A nice option variation, make it a tap back, right? If that lunge feels too much here. Otherwise you're getting down. Stabilizing and returning. Turning on that front glute here, that's gonna help keep your balance, right? Whoo yeah. Drop, press, return. You got it guys. Focus on your strength, on your alignment. Once that's there, then you add that load when you can, when you need to. We got one more here. Fire it back and finish here. Left leg and big rest. Nice job holding that load. We're going to a mid back row, wide and high row. So I want you to bend your knees. Protecting the back more, go to your split stance. Hinge at the hip. We're gonna go mid back. Now, palms turn in, whew, high and wide. Pull close to the body and squeeze that upper back. Keep that chin off chest. Neck is long. Gaze is slightly down toward that floor, right? Make sure the weight is toward your seat. Your core is strong, but you're never holding your breath, right? Especially when you're lifting load. Breathing if you can on the exertion, exhaling. We got it. Strong core and back, guys. One more, let's go. I'm right here with you. And rest. All right, you ready for your next set? We're going. Four knees. Separating the legs a little wider than squat. Coming down, four knees. 
Yes, jump or walk in. Get ready. If coming down doesn't work for you today, come for four squats. One, two, I'll show you an option. Four, come down, position the load, bring it in. You can run this. Now, take it in, waist to the side. You can run this. See what works, four and four. It's your pace, nobody else's. We're moving. Keep that flow. Keep that control. Think of that full plank position here. There it is. Last one. Nice. And shake it out. All right, guys. Way to push through. You have medium to light load. A little bit lighter here. We're coming out. Lateral arms. That's it. I'm going to change a little bit to this. So get ready. Feet are about hip distance apart. Bend those knees. Yes. Now, we're going to go lateral, front, abduct the right leg. Lateral, front raise, abduct the right. You have that base option of just the lateral arms if you need that today. Adding a stability balance challenge here. Now, when you press that leg out here, imagine that you have a band around it. I want you to flex the foot and press into that band. There it is. Whoo! We feeling those arms? I certainly am, guys. Right? Side, front flex. Last one. Side, whoo! Front flex. Rest that for me. Shake that out. Nice job. All right, we're coming down here. Four tricep kicks, four push press. Position yourself. Stay with your medium to light load. Bend the knees, glue the elbows. One, listen. Two, three, four. Bring it up. Push press. Yes, not leaning into this. Two more. One more. Come down, elbows in, hinge, kick it back. Squeeze. Drive it up through the legs. Core is strong. Push. Press. We don't want this getting in the low back. You ready for your last one? We have time for a two and two. Come down. Two kickbacks. One and two. Drive it up. Push, press. One more. Push, press, and shake it out, guys. Way to work. I want you to grab one heavy load. And you're meeting me here in a sumo position, holding that load to the chest. Yes? Your toes are turned out. Chest is lifted. We're going to come down for two. <sighs> Lift up for two. That's it. Come down for two. Little press up. <sighs> I want it slow. I want you to imagine as you rise up, you're squeezing a little mini ball between those inner thighs. So exhale. Keep going. Squeeze here. Draw your waist in. Squeezing the glutes as well. Good. You have that control, not rushing through it, right? Yes. Push to the finish. Finding your strength. Go for it. Ready for your last 10 seconds? One, two, three. Jump option or pulse. One, two, three. One, two, and rest. You guys are awesome. All right, take the load to your right hand. Right leg comes back. We're in a split stance here. It goes row, tricep kick, bend, and return. All right, square those hips, medium to heavy load. Get ready for it, and pull. Press, return. Close to the rib cage right there. Drive it back, kick it back, bend. Kick. Good. Stay long through that torso, through that spine. Burning, burning. One, two, three, to the end. Keep pushing through. 
finding that strength on that row. Think of the back, tricep, back of that arm. How we doing? Almost to the end. I'm sweating with you. One more, one more, and switch, guys. Nice job. All right, you got the other side. Opposite leg forward, okay? Your hips are squared, shoulders are down. Get ready for it. Chin is off that chest. We're gonna hinge forward, all right? Loading that front glute. It goes row, kick, bend. Let's do it. Good. Back of that arm is firing. One, two, three, and four. Press to the end. Good, good. Make sure the chest isn't collapsing down, right? That front leg is working to hold you in this stable position. Then we have the power from the core, from the back, from the triceps. A lot going on here. Getting stronger every day, guys, right? Upping the load where you can, if you can go heavier, shake that out. You guys are awesome. All right, grab your second heavy load. Working through that lower body, everybody good? We're gonna turn that grip. We're doing side squats to the right and to the left. So I want you to start with your legs together, holding that load to the shoulders, one. Two, lateral walks. Three, we go back. One, two, three. We're moving. Bring it up. Nice. And go. One, get low. Two, three. How are those legs feeling, guys? You're feeling the heart rate increase? You're out of breath, but you can talk to me, yes? You can answer me. Not calling me names, right? <laughs> you got it. One more time there, let's go. Two more, push. Last one, shake that out. Going to your medium to light load. Everybody good? Scaption, <laughs> we come, 45 degrees. Bend those knees. Your arms come out to that 45 angle and down. Let's do it. And lower. Using that exhale, using that breath. Nice job. Turn on that core right there. Excellent. Chin is off that chest. Right? I want you to focus here too on the middle and the upper back muscles engaging. So it's not just anterior deltoid, we're stabilizing through the back. So that posture stays nice and strong and you feel that back working, right? Oh yeah. And rest, good. Come down to the floor, guys. All right, everybody have their water closed if you need it. Medium to heavy load. Plank or push up, should I say, position with a row. Now, I might be on my knees here. Coming down for that push up. All right, so if you can, you're coming a full plank. One, two, you're either on the knees or off, chest to the floor. Any variation of this works. Whether you're just holding your rows, you're holding a plank. Where do you need to be today? Keep it strong. Good, good. Chest toward that floor. Pop it up. That back is strong for you, right? That core is strong. We're sweating, we're out of breath, but we're working hard for us. Getting through the workout because we're almost done. Focus now, your mind needs to take over if you're tired. Rest. All right, you got medium to light. Whoo, see where you need to be. Listen carefully here. Your dumbbell comes to your left hand, which means your left knee is bent. All right, you're in an all fours position. Left knee bent, weight to the left arm. Pull the load in, tricep kick. If you try bringing the weight on the other side, you're gonna feel really unbalanced. Now, 
If you're okay here, I want you to add that glute squeeze, that hip extension. You're firing the butt, lifting up that leg as we draw the navel to spine. Right there. Feeling that tricep. Make sure that right arm is strong. We're not collapsing down into that side. This is a lot going on here, right? Left abductors on the leg have to engage. I also have a trick for you, not with the dumbbell, but if when you do this type of work and you lean to the side without weights, prop a ball under that knee, tuck your toe. I'm just showing you as we are in between sets. This is gonna help keep you aligned. It's hard. All right, this is my lesson of the day. <laughs> right knee bends, we're back at it. Right arm, start with that tricep. And you, if you've done my Pilates mini ball classes, You've seen me do that move. Killer, focus on the core. All right, let's talk about this move now. <laughs> Lift the back leg. <sighs> Guys, and also, I know a lot of you are in my fit club, but we do workouts like this, and they're a little bit longer, but each week we meet live. I also do pop-up classes, so I can see you, talk to you, and really, guys, the community helps everyone stay on track. We're held accountable. You have a monthly calendar to use. Keep going here. So I'm gonna post the link down below if you're interested in that. I would absolutely love to have you. I'm sweating. All right, come down. Nice job, guys. One heavy load. Keep it in mind. It's something that could really jumpstart your fitness program, keep you on track. We do nutrition tips, healthy meals. No one diet, because I don't believe there's no one diet for everybody. So we find what works for us. All right, let's go. Your arms are up. Now, pullovers, hold the load. Inhale, exhale. I want the middle and the upper back to engage. I want the core to engage. Now, if I'm okay here, I'm gonna reach the legs. Pull in. Notice our head does not move at all. Not letting the back arch. Lower is harder with the legs, but not if your back is popping up or your ribs are arching. I'll show you like that. I don't even want to do it because it's so bad for your back. So definitely don't want that. We could still be here. Make it your exercise. Yes. And last one. Rest. Bring that down. Hands behind your head. Quick ab series and you're out of here. Rise the heart and chest. Scoop the belly. Now from here, you may say, I don't feel this, I don't know. I want you to focus on keeping space here. Imagine someone's poking you in the belly button. Now draw the belly in deeper, lift an inch higher. Do you guys feel that difference? Hold that difference, hold on to it. That doesn't wanna change. Right knee and left leg out. You're squeezing the buttocks here. Look, I'm not even rushing. Thinking of that length, fingertips are loose, my belly should be burning. Switch it. See the difference when we go really slow. Switch it. Holding on to that core strength, holding on to it. Chin is off that chest. There's so much to think about, right? I may start to do this and I have to tell myself, nope, get back in alignment. <laughs> All right, you ready guys? Stay with this. One knee in, you're gonna twist to that bent knee. Wide elbows, chin up chest. Slowly rotate, knee in. Rotation and twist. Rotation and twist. Right there you have it, yes. <sighs> Can you show me four more here? Let's do it, we got four. Oh yeah, we got three, burning on fire, two, and meet me in center. We're not going anywhere. Legs are together at tabletop position. Squeeze those inner thighs. Slowly hold that, hold that, hold that. You're gonna tap the right toe. Bring it in, left toe. If you don't feel this, you may be doing this, <laughs> right? So imagine your knees are glued. They can't move at all. You have to move from the hip. Look at that difference. Don't let that back arch, Shh, bring it in. Go slow, bring it in. You don't necessarily have to touch the floor here. You're gonna go to your range of motion. Now, squeeze your inner thighs together, go halfway down, lift up. Halfway down, lift up. Four more, let's do it. You got four, your belly should be on fire. Three, two, hold on one, extend those legs up, 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 up. Drop down for two, 
flex up for two. If head has to rest down, that's certainly okay. Lift, show me four more here. We are done, my friends, four. Inhale, lower, exhale, three. That belly is burning, two, and whoo. Shake that out, roll up, my friends. When we do those moves correctly, we don't need to be doing them for hours, right? Palms under the shoulders, using that breath. I want you to come to that exhale and round. Now, coming out of this, let the tailbone hit the back wall. Extend forward, gazing out in front. You're gonna feel a stretch through the abdominals, which feels amazing. And one more time, lifting, scooping, rounding, stretching low back. And then let that release. Drawing chin off chest. And my friends, we are done. If you have a little bit of more time today, skip the warm up and go through this circuit one or maybe two more times. But I felt the burn, guys, in just under 30 minutes. I'm dripping sweat. I hope you are too. If you liked it, please be sure to click the like button, hit the bell so every time I post a new workout, you'll get notified. All right, I'm gonna post my Fit Club information down below. And also, guys, my 12. Um, DVD 90 day program that is now launched on Amazon. Super excited. Take a look at that. I will also post that link down below. If you need me, info at workouthotel.com. Have a beautiful, have a blessed day. I will see you next workout, guys. Stay focused. Workout, move every day. Listen to your body. Take care.